Good morning, party people. We got the boat covered up here. It is a nice morning. Um, I wasn't expecting this. It's only 5 a.m. right now. 5.00 a.m. And it's daylight out. Um, originally had my alarm set for 5 a.m., but my dad got up at 4. And at like 4.30, it was already starting to break daylight, and I was awake, so I just got up. We found a pretty good topwater spot for today that should be fantastic. Hopefully, we can get on some topwater fish. I'm talking frogs, buzzbaits, spooks, poppers, all the topwater stuff. We're going to try it all. My buddy on YouTube comes in around midday, around 1-ish, whatever. So, he'll be here then. But for now, this these beautiful birds and to make the day even better, coffee. When I came out this door to do this little like cool cutscene, so I came out right there, like right here was a freaking raccoon just staring at me. It was the most terrifying experience of my life. But my dad's gonna finish showering, we're gonna get this boat uncovered, get to the boat ramp, go catch some topwater fish. Today should be exciting. There's one. Awesome. Nice. On the frog. My first frog fish ever. Nice, Tanner. On the frog. I had my frog. He's warm. My frog. I just sat it there. I uh, yeah, it a little slow. I popped it over a tree. It landed in the water, and I just sat it there. That's awesome, guys. That's my um, first ever frog fish here. He choked it. He hammered it. Good first fish. Oh. Nice one. First ever frogfish right there. So I, I cast it up in the weeds up there. Just I have 65 pound braid, so I just cast it as, fur, as far up in the weeds as I could. We're sitting in 43 feet of water. Yeah, we're sitting in 43 feet of water and we're just fishing these little islands with these little, cause the, I mean, this lake is 10 foot above summer pool. So we're just, all I did is I casted it as far up into those weeds as I could get it. And it got hung on a tree, so I popped it over the top of a tree. And it came, um, uh, it just, it landed. And I just let it sit there, because I was looking at my phone. And I just heard a wake and an instant pull, so he choked it. You got all that. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys real quick the frog that I choose. This, I'm pretty sure this is a booyah, just regular frog. It's, um, it's got some browns, some blacks. A yellow bottom um, some greens just a kind of natural frog with some darks on it and I trimmed the uh, skirts down and you always want to trim one skirt uh, shorter than the other um, because that allows you to work it one way better than the other oh that bass was chasing it he chased it out of the water for it He wanted it bad. He chased it out of the freaking water. Dude! That thing was like, that was like a four pounder. Oh, guys. My GoPro wasn't on. Guys, my GoPro got all bent up. He hooked one. It was about, it's, it was a bucket mouth. That's all I got to say. I, all I saw was the bucket mouth. It was big. Okay, it was very large my drag is not set that's a good one that's a good one yeah get him get him get him get him get him that's a good one yep Barely hooked. 
That's a good one. Um, he is a 17 incher. You want to keep him for a picture? 17. You want to keep him for a picture? You can take the picture with the camera. No, let's see if we can get a bunch. We'll keep him for a picture. So that fish that we caught over here, um, we're just gonna take a picture of him now and let him go because we don't want to drag him like a mile back to the marina. So. Okay. Where's your head at? You do your thing, buddy. It's not a bad fish. That's cool. Is it? Oh yeah. What is wrong with that fish? Dude. <laughs> Here I got your What is wrong with that fish? I've never caught a spot. Yeah, that's a spot. What is wrong with that thing? What is wrong with that? What is, what? He's just, got, that's just marking. Yeah, he got hit by a pike or something. That's insane. Yeah.